Welcome back, this is Junk Dump, and today we're going to be drilling and reaming valve guides. Now this is going to apply to Oldsmobile engines, but I'll basically be using the same procedure for other engines as well. To start things off, I have to get down and make sure that the worktop is at the correct angle, as in I want to set that to my valve guide angle in the heads. And the correct valve guide angle or valve angle for Oldsmobiles is 6 degrees. And I'll be using a piloted drill slash reamer. This tool is unique in that it will center itself uh, via the piloted end. You can see it's a smaller diameter. And then it drills it out to an outer diameter and reams it and then does a final reaming to the final outer diameter that you're looking for. And you'll see me using this water mixed cutting slash grinding slash coolant fluid. This is kind of an oily substance that you keep around a machine shop and then you dilute it with water depending on what you're going to be using. And this particular cutting bit is going to be run at around 750 RPM, so we're already set up for that. Throughout the video you're going to notice the bit looks like it's getting super hot and there's like smoke coming off of it, but it's really deceiving because the shop is actually very cold. It's in like the high 30s, low 40s. And as I back the bit out, you can see the drilling looks great thus far, and we're going to continue going. And now you can see how much material is removed just on the top here. Um, the drilling and reaming was completed in a single action, and that, that really is the benefit to having this style bit. And I'll speed up the recording as we finish off the remaining guides. Oldsmobiles do have excellent valve guide angles. You can see here they're six degrees, and that's uh, that really is advantageous in many ways. And all of this work is going to prepare us for the installing of the brand new guides. I don't like using shims or sleeves, um, so I'm going to drill these out and put brand new guides in. And that's going to complete the drilling and reaming operations that I do before installing new valve guides. Once again, I am junked up, and I appreciate any comments that you guys leave, and I do try to respond to all of them. Thanks for watching!